Hi there guys, it's Rig here. Hope you're all doing extremely well out there. I know I am. Today we're going to take a look at the hybrid pentatonic scale. I know most of you out there are going, what the hell is a hybrid pentatonic scale? Um, but uh, it's not that complicated at all. In fact, it's remarkably simple. So I'm going to explain this basic concept to you. Uh, it's a great sounding scale, basically, which is comprised of two different minor pentatonics bung together, cut and pasted together. That's all it is. Um, I'm using a backing track here. Uh, well, I'm using a backing track that I will uh, demonstrate the scale within a bit. But uh, the backing track I, I'm playing over uses a very, 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 very common chord progression. Four, two, four, five. We're actually taking chords from the G major scale, but it's a Dorian fan, so we're taking chord two, four, five, okay, which gives us a Dorian feel. Okay, um, and the first scale that most guitarists go to when uh, playing or presented with um, a progression like this is, of course, the old A minor scale, which is built upon the second degree of our major scale. Uh, so we end up with A minor pentatonic. Okay, uh, just as a side note before we get into me showing you the scale, it's important to understand that we can build a minor pentatonic scale based on the second, third, and sixth degrees of any major scale. Let me explain that again. A minor pentatonic scale we can build from the second, third, and sixth degrees of the major scale, okay? So same formula, one, flat three, four, five, flat seven, okay? So here's G major, here's the second degree. We can take... That fits with a minor seven. Surprise, surprise, A minor seven. Third degree, do the same thing. One flat three, five, sorry, one flat three, four, five, flat seven, okay? We have a B minor pentatonic, and finally, chord number six, three number six. That's an E minor pentatonic, again with the same formula. And what we're going to do is instead of um, swapping scales, because those scales will work, you can mix them all up when you're improvising. Um, but instead of doing that, I like to create one entire scale by combining two of those pentatonics. In this case, we're going to take the A minor, okay, on the bottom three strings, so string six, five, four, we're going to play A minor pentatonic. But on the upper three strings, three, two, and one, we're going to play E minor pentatonic. So, we have a hybrid pentatonic scale, a combination of two pentatonics, A minor, E minor. Great sounding scale, okay. Intervallically, what we have when we play the scale over the A root, we have uh, obviously 1 flat 3, 4, 5 flat 7. But when we play the E minor, we have the 9th and 11th extensions added. So it allows us to get more of a sort of fresh, sort of slightly jazzier feel by adding that E minor pentatonic in to create those extensions, the 9th and the 11th. Okay, over this this chord, we get the 13th added as well. Uh, anyway, um, don't want to go too into detail there, but this is what we're going to concentrate on. So this will spice up your improvising no end by adding those extensions in. But what we've got to do is treat this as one whole scale, you know, rather than seeing them as two separate scales. And as such, we can practice it in the same way that we practice our regular minor pentatonic scales. And that's exactly what we're going to do right now. So let's do it. We're going to play all five positions. Okay, let's go.
Okay, so there we have all of our five uh, positions of the hybrid pentatonic scale. Like I say before, it's important to practice this just as you would for a minor pentatonic scale. Um, and you can take even, you don't have to play the entire scale when you're improvising, you can just take the, the upper... digressing there with my playing. <laughs> you can take the upper portion of the... Okay, the upper portion of the E minor pentatonic. Uh, okay, good. I hope you've enjoyed this lesson. I hope you've got a lot out of it. Um, so get practicing the hybrid pentatonic scale, okay? Uh, just as a little um, side note, make sure you check out my website, sale currently on. I will leave the link in the description box below as always. And it's a fantastic way to support what I do so I can do more videos like this for you guys. Okay, thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video. Cheers.